Hi, this is Amit from Digital Inspiration and today I'll share a simple tip that will help keep your Google contacts up to date all the time with the help of your friends. Let's see how. Now here are my Google contacts and as you can see, I have their names and their email addresses, but all the other information like their postal addresses, their phone numbers, their birthdays or even their blog URLs, I don't have any of this information. So how do I get this missing information into my Google contacts? Now one obvious solution is that I send them an email or make a phone call and whatever information they share with me, I put it into my Google contacts manually. Or there's a better way. I can send them a form which they can fill and as soon as they press submit, the information is automatically added to my Google contacts without me having to do anything. Let's see how. First go to Google contacts and select all the contacts who are missing information. We will basically send them an email requesting information. So select these contacts and put them in a group. For this example, we will create a new group. Let's call it personal. You can give any name, but just make sure you remember this name because we will need it later. Once the group has been created, go to your Google scripts and make a copy of this sheet. So you go to file, make a copy to create a copy of the sheet into your Google Drive account. You can find a link in the show notes. Next, you need to make two changes to this sheet. First, uh, put your full name here. Now this name will appear in the signature of your outgoing email. So just replace this with your full name. Next, you need to replace personal with the actual group that you created in Google contacts. So in our case, it's personal, but you need to put the exact name here. Next, we need to publish our script. So go to file, manage versions and save this as a new version. You can put anything in the text box or leave it blank and just click save a new version and click OK. Now go to publish and choose deploy as web app. Now in this dialog, leave everything as default, but under who has access to the app, change it from only myself to anyone, including anonymous. Basically, we are telling Google scripts that even non-Google users, people who don't have Google accounts should be able to access our uh, web form without having to log in. So we are almost done setting up the script and need to run it now. So go to run and choose initialize. Now the first time you run the script, it will require you to authorize access to a few services like email, contacts, etc. So just choose authorize here and grant the necessary access. Once you are done that, go back to run and choose initialize again to actually run the script. So the script has executed successfully and emails have been sent out to all members who were part of that Google contacts group. Let's now see how that uh, email looks like and what your friends and colleagues have to do in order to update their entries in Google contacts. So this is the mailbox of one of your colleagues who got that message and there you see that message requesting for contact information. Let's open this message. Now in this message you see there's a link that says click here to fill in the required details. Now if your colleague clicks that link, a new form will open up where he or she can fill in their contact details. So in this form, they can update their name, mailing address, mobile phone, the Skype ID, birthday. Uh, all of the fields are editable except for the email address. So let's quickly fill in some dummy data into this form. Once they're done entering the data, they can click the update button to uh, send the details to your Google contacts and a small confirmation pops up. Now switch to your Google contacts and there you see all the details entered by your colleague are now available in your Google contacts without you having to do a thing. Their mailing address, phone number, everything is available in Google contacts instantly. Thanks.